This is a question about area and perimeter. Here you see a grid of regular hexagons. The fact that they're regular means that all the sides are the same length and all the angles inside the shapes are the same. That's the reason it fits together nicely in this honeycomb shape. The shaded shape here has an area of three hexagons, one, two, three, and a perimeter of 14 centimeters, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Okay, what have we been asked to do? We've been asked to draw another shape on the grid which has an area of four hexagons and a perimeter of 14 centimeters. So, we've got to start somewhere. So let's start somewhere in the middle and let's shade in one hexagon. Because it's a hexagon, the area, it, the, the perimeter is one, two, three, four, five, six. We want just one shape, so we've got to join it up. If we join it up, we've now got a shape with an area of two hexagons. But what's the perimeter? We're tempted to say it's six plus six because it's two hexagons. But it isn't because there's a joining line. So let's see what it is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So the perimeter is now ten centimeters. Okay, so we've got to do draw two more hexagons. Well, if we put another one over here, we're going to be back to this, and we'll already have an area of 14. So, let's put it in here and see what happens. I think I said an area of 14. Of course, I meant a perimeter of 14. So, we've now got a shape, which is three hexagons big. Let's have a look at the perimeter. One two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So we're doing okay. We've still got two more, uh, two more centimeters to play with. Okay, let's put one in here and see what happens. So we've now got a shape with one, two, three, four, an area of four hexagons. And let's have a look what the perimeter is. Let's start down here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen centimeters. So here we've got a shape which has got an area four hexagons and a perimeter of 14 centimeters and so we've correctly solved the problem.